This video will provide an overview of teacher assigned devices. Teacher assigned devices, also known as TADs, are laptops that are assigned to individual teachers. These devices will offer elevated rights, flexibility, and mobility inside and outside the classroom. The TAD program began at 40 schools in the 2016 and 2017 school year. It is important when you first receive your TAD at school to power on the TAD laptop, log in with your lead account, and then restart the device. If this first time step is not completed, you will not be able to log into the laptop outside of school. It is important to ensure that your data is protected as the files can now be saved locally to the computer. Users are responsible for backing up their data as hardware failures or complications can happen without notice. Computers may be reimaged without notice and it is the assigned user's responsibility to restore their data from backups. The two recommended backup options are the home drive, otherwise known as the H drive, and the Microsoft OneDrive. The H drive provides individual storage, which is available on the LCPS network and on LCPS computers but the H drive is not accessible outside LCPS locations. Microsoft OneDrive is an internet cloud storage solution, which is accessible from computers, tablets, and phones. Users are able to view, edit, collaborate online through Office 365, and multiple device syncing is available for offline file use. Teachers will have elevated rights, which are specifically configured for the assigned user. Because of the elevated rights, students should not log on or use TAD equipment. Teacher assigned devices are allocated to the school, and it is important to return your equipment to the school when you are transferring to another location and or leaving the county. Assigned users may connect to outside networks. However, technical difficulties with non-LCPS networks are not supported. Assigned users have the ability to install lightweight software. However, installation may fail if elevated system access is needed. Unapproved DOI software is purchased at your own risk, and DTS cannot guarantee the compatibility of unapproved software. It is important to back up and safeguard unapproved purchase software licenses in the event that a re-image is needed. The portal manager allows for the installation of DOI approved software. If a software title is not included in the portal manager, Users can submit new requests through the software procurement application. Sign users are required to self-install LCPS printers. LCPS printers include Xerox copiers and LaserJet printers. Non-DTS provided printers may be installed using Windows preloaded print drivers. However, some printers may not be compatible and non-DTS printers are not supported. TADs are configured so that teachers can customize their personal start menus and desktops. Devices will no longer display the school's custom menus, desktop icons, and links. Instead, a desktop shortcut is provided for the teacher resource folder, but this shortcut is not available on outside LCPS networks. The first time login must be completed at school on an LCPS network. Teacher assigned devices must be brought to an LCPS site at least once every 30 days to be logged on to and restarted. This is important to ensure that updates, patches, and policies are appropriately applied. Failure to do so could result in a computer becoming inoperable and potentially need to be re-imaged. If you need any assistance or have any questions on teacher assigned devices, please contact the school support team or the DTS service desk.